Hi, my name is Shane. I'm a Dyson expert. And in this video, I'm going to be explaining how the light cycle morph transforms and the different lighting modes that it can provide. So the light cycle morph gives you four different lighting options in one. You've got your task lighting, feature lighting, indirect lighting, and then ambient lighting as well. If we take a look at our task lighting first, by pointing the head down at a 90 degree angle towards your workspace, it provides a focused, powerful beam of light that's designed and engineered to help reduce eye strain. The light cycle morph will automatically focus in on whatever task it is you're trying to do. So for example, if I take a book here and I hold it under that beam of light, you'll see it's automatically adapting and adjusting to focus in on that for me. If I then move it away, it will then distribute the light out over a wider space. This is perfect if you share your workspace with somebody as it ensures that you're getting the optimal lighting conditions while focused in on your task and then also not disturbing others at the same time as well. The next lighting option that we have is our feature lighting. So by moving the arm and then rotating it up, say like this, for example, this is perfect for showcasing something in within your room or within your home, whether that's a piece of artwork or a feature within the building that you'd like to, to illuminate. It provides really nice lighting for making the most out of whatever it is you're looking to showcase. Our next lighting mode that we have then is indirect lighting. So by rotating the head up, this diffuses the light out over a wider space, creating nice soft background lighting and also helping to enhance the sense of space as well. So perfect for smaller rooms or darker rooms where you really want to kind of make the most out of the space that you have. The colour and uh, temperature and the intensity of the light can also be adjusted to your liking as well. So it's quite nice to introduce warmer tones if you're using it in this mode. And then our final lighting mode that we have is our ambient lighting. So by moving the arm back down to 90 degrees and then rotating it in towards the base, it will magnetically seal with the base here. You've got a magnetic seal that's going to help to stop any light spilling out from here and then you have a blue light filter within the base as well so this is going to eliminate a lot of that blue light to create a more relaxing warming environment again the color temperature can be adjusted to your liking here but this provides really nice lighting for the evening time to help you relax and unwind while also still providing enough light for tasks like reading for more information, see Dyson.ie or leave a comment down below using the hashtag Ask a Dyson Expert.